You'll have to forgive him for the pro wrestler look. The scraggly hair and beard, tattoos down his arm, and the connotation they all come with. Senior tight end Zane Fakes might not look like much of an academic. Yeah, um, I've heard that plenty of times, obviously. But uh, academics has always been uh, important to me. It's, my parents have harped on it since I was in elementary school. Um, and I just knew from the get-go that it was something that I had to get done. Getting it done is an understatement. Fakes was named an academic All-American this month. Just the 12th player in Ball State football history. Briggs got it, who had a 4.0 all the way up until his last semester. He got an A minus. To hear my name amongst guys like that, it's it takes me. It's pretty weird for me, kind of still. An exercise science major with a 3.5 GPA, Fakes plans on going into strength coaching after college, hoping to build the next generation of D1 athletes especially those following closely to his own path. When I was in high school, um, I went to two different personal trainers that helped me get a scholarship from Ball State and get to play football at the D1 level. So I just kind of want to help kids that are on the edge like, like I was that aren't necessarily, they have the tools, but they're not completely developed athletically. I think Zane could be a, a phenomenal strength coach. Uh, he brings a, one hell of a presence uh, physically, and that, that's a great thing. Uh, but also he understands, I think he understands the human body really, really well, and I think he understands why we train and why we work out. Uh, and that kind of person makes a really, really good strength coach. Jason Roberson was Fakes' boss, so to speak, during his internship in the Ball State weight room this past spring. An invaluable step towards his All-American status. Roberson taught me more more than I can and coach Feely I learned with coach Feely every single day I'm in there and he because he knows I want to be a strength coach so every time he gets a chance to pull me in and tell me why we're doing this or why we're doing that um, he does he came in he was very respectful very quiet um, but you could tell he was intelligent you could tell he knew he was, what he was doing um, when you'd ask him a question the wheels were turning really really quick um, I didn't work with him as an athlete I only worked with him as an academic and so uh, I do know that he's an intelligent kid and he worked really hard and he, he applies himself that's for sure and yet the honor took fakes by surprise he found out about it kind of by accident Twitter you found out on Twitter Brian Harden tweeted it and I got it on my phone I was like well that's that's cool. Yeah, pretty cool indeed. Joel Godet for BallStateSports.com.